Assalamu alaikum dear students and welcome to part 4 of chapter 2 decimal numbers. At the end of this video, students will be able to multiply decimals. The materials that we should prepare are a pen, a draft paper, your math practice book edition 2019, your textbook edition 2013. We are going first to remember how we used to multiply two natural numbers. Multiply 301 times 2. The first step will be to arrange the numbers above each other. Now we are going to multiply 2 by all the digits found above. Begin by multiplying 2 by 1. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 0 now is 0. 2 times 3 is 6. The answer of our multiplication is called the product. Our product here is 602. Multiply 725 times 56. The first step will be to arrange these two numbers above each other. We will begin by multiplying 6 with all the digits found above it. Now, 6 times 5 is 30. We cannot put two digits beside each other. We will leave the 0 over here and put the 3 above the 2. Now, 6 times 2 is 12. Then, add the number found above the 2 to 12. It is 12 plus 3, we will get 15. We put 5 over here and 1 above the 7. Now, 6 times 7 is 42. 42 with 1 will be 43. Once you are done multiplying 6 with the digits above it, we are going to move to the next digit. 5 is in the place of 10s. Then, we are going to add a 0 once we move to the tens digit and now continue your multiplication. 5 multiplied by 5 now is 25. We put 5 over here and 2 above. Now 5 times 2 is 10 plus 2 it is 12. Put 2 over here 1 above the 7. 5 multiplied by 7 is 35 plus 1 it is 36. Now add these two products, put 0 in the empty place. 0 plus 0 is 0. 5 plus 5 is 10. We put 0 over here, 1 above the 3. Now 3 plus 2 is 5, plus 1 it is 6. 4 plus 6 is 10, put 0 over here and 1 above the 0. 0 plus 3 is 3, plus 1 it is 4. Then our product is 40,600. Multiplication of two decimals. To multiply decimals, multiply as you do for natural numbers. Count the number of digits after the decimal point in each factor, add them. The position of decimal point in the product is placed after the sum of the decimal and digits in the two terms. Example, multiply 0 0.007 times 0 0.4. We will arrange these two numbers above each other in order to multiply them. Now, we will multiply these two numbers as if they are natural numbers, ignoring the zeros and the decimal points found in them. Begin by multiplying 4 by 7. 4 times 7 is 28. Now, count the digits found after the decimal point in the first number. We have three digits in the decimal part. In the second number, we have one digit in the decimal part. 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. This means that we are going to leave 4 digits after the decimal point in our product. 1, 
2, we have an empty place. We will fill it with a 0. 3, now 4, the fourth place, will be also filled with a 0. Locate your decimal point. We cannot leave the whole number part empty. We will put also a 0. This means that our product is 0 0.0028. Application. Multiply 96.054 times 0 0.82. Please pause the video and solve the application. Our solution is... First, we arranged the numbers above each other. Now, we are going to multiply 2 by all the digits found above. 2 times 4 is 8. 2 times 5 is 10, we will put 0 over here, 1 above the 0, 2 times 0 is 0, plus 1 is 1, 2 times 6 is 12, we will put 2 over here, 1 above the 9, 2 times 9 is 18, plus 1 it is 19. Now, we will move to the next digit, then we are going to add a zero. Eight now, multiplied by all the digits above it, we will begin with eight times four. Eight times four is 32. We are going to put two over here and three above the five. Now, eight times five is 40 plus three. 43. 3 will be put over here and 4 above the 0. 8 times 0 is 0 plus 4 it is 4. Now 8 multiplied by 6 is 48. We are going to put 8 over here and 4 above the 9. Now 8 times 9 is 72 plus 4 it is 76. It is time now to add the product of these two numbers. Take care that we didn't multiply 0 by the digits above it because the product will be definitely 0. Now begin by adding these digits. Put 0 in the empty place. 8 plus 0 is 8. 0 plus 2 is 2. 1 plus 3 is 4. 2 plus 4 is 6, 9 plus 8 is 17, put 7 over here and 1 above the 1, 1 plus 6 is 7, plus 1 it is 8, 0 plus 7 is 7. Now we are going to place the decimal point. As we already know, we should count the digits in the first number. We have 3 digits after the decimal point. We have also two digits after the decimal point. In the second number, 2 plus 3 is 5. Now, starting from the right side, leave five digits and then place your decimal point. Our product is 78.76,428. Your assignment will be to review page 23, multiplication A from the textbook. Your homework will be to solve exercise 44, page 32 from the textbook. As a summary, in chapter 2 decimal numbers we took till now, how to write a decimal number in standard form, such as 10.506, in word form, such as 10 and 506 thousandths. In expanded form, 10 plus 0 0.5 plus 0 0.006. We also learned how to read decimal numbers and how to perform calculations. These calculations are addition, subtraction, multiplication. Thank you for following.